So yesterday I posted two videos on this channel about the Alexa Capitania redesign. If you haven't seen them, here's how it looks. I've moved the buttons down here, I've added a little ribbon effect up here, and golden text, the notes still work the same. But the main highlight is that I've changed the buttons to be a black tone and a bit smaller. This has two implications. One, they are not as crazy colorful as they were before. And two, it leaves more space for people to add their own categories. If you are a mod pack developer, or an add-on developer, or if I just one day just happen to want to add more categories, I can do so without having to just fill up the whole book with more stuff and not leave enough, not leave enough space for other people. Animation-wise, I have removed the tooltips and I've put them up here. You can see it says generating flora up there. When you hover over something with your cursor, I actually have the cursor disabled, um, but if you hover over something, you can see it has a little stroke effect. I posted two takes yesterday, a little stroke effect, and, um, and a little blobbish effect. Most people prefer the blobbish effect, that was the first one. Yet, I I prefer the second one, I prefer the stroke effect, so we're sticking with the stroke effect. If you prefer any other effect though, this is actually based on a texture, so you can change it using a resource pack. But I think most people already saw those videos, so I'm going to go into the main highlight of this one, and that is something I've had a lot of people complain to me about, that being the problem that Batania has too much stuff, and is very daunting for a new player. So how do we go about fixing that? Well, obviously we can't remove stuff. An option would be to just gate the stuff and hide features that aren't relevant. It's kind of like what we do with the Elven knowledge. But that'll be too much gating in my opinion, and I don't want to create another Farmcraft research system. So what I've done is not to remove unnecessary features, but to make it easier to access the gist of what you want to know. So if you look over something and you can see I have mystical flowers selected because the little gray thing behind it, if I see, if I press my shift key, this will show up. And this has a little blue, uh, sorry, a little green and white text, which has a tagline basically telling you what each entry is about. And on the top you have the amount of pages and the recipes that it teaches you how to make. Now I had to write a tagline for every single entry in the book and, and that took a long time, there's actually a lot of stuff in this book and now I'm starting to realize why people don't want to translate Batania. But either way, if we go into something that you can be a better example, you can very quickly have a look through this and see what each feature does. So instead of having to go and read all of the entries, you can just have a very quick glance and figure out which ones you're interested in. So that's about it for the Alexica Batania redesign features. I may add some more small things, but this is the, the only major feature I've wanted to add and I've actually wanted to add for a while. And it should be available in the next version of Batania. Oh well, see ya.